Praise the Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. Hi, welcome in. February 28, intercession. If anyone sees his brother commit a sin, he should pray and God will give him life. 1 John 5, verse 16. On the last evening when Jesus promised to send the Holy Spirit, he said, remain in me and I will remain in you. If a man remains in me and I in him, he will bear much fruit. John 15, verses 4 to 5. This, he taught, would be attained through prayer. If we pray, God will grant us our desires. Christ made a sevenfold promise. I will do whatever you ask in my name. John 14, verse 13. You may ask me for anything in my name and I will do it. Verse 14. If my words remain in you, ask whatever you wish and it will be given you. John 15, verse 7. The Father will give you whatever you ask in my name. Verse 16. Ask and you will receive and your joy will be complete. John 16, verse 24. And in that day you will ask in my name, verse 26. The believer has the privilege of praying for others, knowing that Christ and the Father will answer that prayer. Remember that you are a branch of the vine, not only for your own salvation, but to bear fruit by leading others to conversion. As an intercessor, grace is granted you to pray for others in the firm belief that God will answer your prayer. Think of that, pardon me, think of the change that would come over a community if every believer took time to pray for those who do not believe. How God would be glorified in our bearing much fruit. Thank you, Lord, for the wonderful promises you have given concerning the bearing of fruit through intercession. Make me faithful in my prayer life for myself and for the world. 